Hey, and welcome to Yayu's Corner. So today I have an exciting haul for you. It's uh, a lot of skincare, um, makeup, and hair products. Oh, one hair product. Okay, so let's get into it. So let's start with something that has been working for me. I've noticed, I mean, ever since I started using these products, um, my son's dermatologist um, recommends this brand to my son who's starting to get blackheads. So this is the Different Pore Minimizing Toner with Witch Hazel. I don't know how many bottles of this we've gone through. We use it, both him and I use it day and night, okay? Day and night. Even sometimes when he comes back from school, being like all sweaty and everything, he's not going to take a shower yet, but I tell him, go wash your hands and clean your face with a cotton pad, and he swipes this on his face. I also purchased the Daily Deep Cleanser for sensitive um, skin. It's oil absorbing, moisture releasing. This cleanser was developed with dermatologists to deliver the power of maximum strength, benzoyl peroxide, but with less dryness and irritation. The dual action micronized formula penetrates deep into the pores to absorb excess oil while releasing a gentle moisturizer that won't clog pores. So really all you need is a pea size and it does foam up just a little bit, but it's very gentle. So yeah, these were, I think I purchased these in CVS. I think they had a sale going on. So whenever I see those products on sale, I grab them. Now for hair products. I am loving the Jisoo Honey Infused Hair Oil. This is amazing. I mean, I'm loving it. So I, I had originally purchased the 0.7 ounce size. So I had 20 bucks in rewards and I went ahead and I purchased the 3.4 ounce. So I am going to keep this um, for my son in his uh, bathroom and then I'll keep the larger size. Now, I do have to say that this size came in the most beautiful presentation. The box was gorgeous. I think I threw it away already. Um, yeah, it was beautiful. I was tempted to keep it, but I'm like, no, I'm not gonna keep another box. Presentation on this, well packaged, so it doesn't just come like this. It's It comes in a box, okay? As opposed to the smaller size that comes, I think, in a little box. This one comes in a box, hard cardboard box, um, embedded within another cardboard. I mean, the presentation is gorgeous on that um, hair oil. Okay, moving on to, let's see. Um, yes, this is skincare. So, I'm not sure when this came out. I want to say this is new. This is the Super Goop CC Screen. 100% mineral CC cream. I purchased it in the size in the size in the color 206W. It has SPF 50. This is um so I'll read you what the what the box says. CC screen 100% mineral CC cream SPF 50 is a super gentle antioxidant rich formula that, de that delivers instant luminosity, evens out skin tone and protects from UVA and UVB rays. It's makeup meets skincare for every day, leaving your skin with a fresh sing with a fresh natural finish. Okay. I didn't know this, but the Supergoop creator Holly Thaggard, uh she started in 2007. Huh. All right. This is for all skin types, 100% mineral sunscreen actives natural finish, oil-free, reef-safe, non-irritating, no, synth no synthetic fragrance, vegan, cruelty-free. So, yeah, so I got this on, so the, the different um, toner and facial cleanser, I got that at CVS. This I purchased this at um, Sephora. These two products, which I'll show you now, this I got from Violet Gray. They, they had a 20% sale going on and I went ahead and I 
pulled the trigger on this. Okay, so this is the 206W color. Let's see. I'm going to swatch it for you. Okay, it is, it's not runny at all. Okay. Um, it is pretty thick. It's not runny at all, but it's not oily either. Look at that. Very nice. And I don't want to say it's matte because there is a little bit of glow there, but no fragrance. I think I'm going to like this. I am going to pair it up. I'm definitely going to do a look with this. I'm going to pair it up with, maybe I'll do half a face with the glow screen underneath and then half a face with just the um, CC green. I'm so excited they came out with this because honestly, this uh, the Unseen Sunscreen, I love that stuff. I have it on today. I was outside. I filmed one video this morning. I went outside, uh, obviously under the umbrella. I fell asleep outside and it's not, I mean, it's very sunny, but it's also breezy. And my skin still feels great. It doesn't feel oily or anything. I haven't had to, um, you know, uh, pat it down or anything. So I can just imagine this, and I have the La Mer um, foundation on today. I can just imagine this under the glow screen or the unseen sunscreen. I'm so happy they came out with this. I, I couldn't believe it when I saw this. Anyways, very excited about using this. Feels super soft, awesome. I mean, it doesn't feel oily, doesn't feel matte. It just feels like your skin, it feels bouncy. Okay, very excited about that. Then I also saw, which I think this is new as well, it's called the Bright Eyed 100% Mineral Eye Cream. I was so excited to see this that I had put two in my cart. I was like, oh, you know what? I'm like, the, I can't believe, at least I'm not aware of any product that is specifically made with SPF 40 to put under your eyes. Do you know how important that is? I mean, especially for me, my skin under my eyes, it's like every day it ages more and more. And I mean, I wish I, I wish they had come out with this in 2007, but hey, they came out with it now and I'm so happy. So this has 40 SPF. Uh, so this protects one of your most delicate and sun sensitive spots which too often goes without SPF. The non-nano zinc oxide formula keeps skin hydrated and eyes looking brighter. So directions apply generously and evenly 15 minutes before sun exposure. Reapply at least every two hours. This is great. I mean, I'm going to be um, going on vacation to one of the hottest and sunniest places in the US and I cannot wait to start using this. Let's see. So it, it, it comes in a pump, okay? Here we go. All right. So it's not runny at all. color but no scent I mean it's got a super faint scent look at that I should have bought two now I know I think I'm gonna really love this these two things <laughs> plus the glow screen and the sunscreen they're gonna be my best friends this is uh, 0.5 fluid ounces. I mean, it does say apply generously and you need to reapply. So I should have bought another one. Well, you know what? That's fine. I know I have one, uh, should last me throughout the summer. And if not, but this is a great, 
great product to have. It's like underneath your eyes, I can tell every day, it's like it gets more wrinkled with every day that passes. And that's me buying huge sunglasses all the time. I buy the biggest sunglasses. I mean, my husband makes fun of me, but it's funny because my sister gave me for Mother's Day. I love these. I'm gonna put, I'm gonna link these down. Look at these. I love these sunglasses. I love them. And you know why I've always, the type of sunglasses I always try to um, buy are sunglasses that cover the whole um, eye area because of this, because of the sun rays. I don't want any wrinkles around my eyes. And if I can find them with like side things here, even better. But these are the most comfortable sunglasses. These are going with me on vacation. So my sister gave me these, which are a, a brown tortoise. Look at these, how beautiful. They're so well made. Look at that. Um, and I also purchased them in black. So these are gonna go with me on vacation. I think they're great. And I think on Amazon, they're listed under like 70s uh, sunglasses, but I love them and they're so light, but they cover you. It's like they hug your face. Awesome. So um, yeah, I just thought I'd throw that in there. Part of the reason why this is so important. Okay, so that's that. Then, what else did I purchase? Okay, so I went ahead and this is a repurchase. This is a gel exfoliant, anti-pollution exfoliating gel. This is, um, let's see. It's an exfoliating gel with jojoba beads and mineral rich seawater gently removes impurities and dead skin for a smoother brighter appearance with a diminished look of pores use two to three times a week on wet or dry skin and then rinse off so this i use in the shower i already used it oh i mean do i need to tell you about how i love sense but so this is a very mm. okay and it's got these little micro beads I'm not sure if you can see them they and it's just the most delicate um scrub so what I do is I get in the shower I wet my face a little bit and I start with this. I also have, um, I have two more in the shower with me. The Peter Roth Thomas or Peter Thomas Roth. I don't know what, what it's called, but it's a pumpkin um, scrub. I love it. And then I also have the um, Huda Beauty, the Wish scrub, which has fruit enzymes. I love that one too. That one's just like this where the the little um granules are so tiny and this oh this just smells amazing it smells amazing and then i paired up with my Southies um face wash and it just it's a lovely experience in the morning when you're getting up to go to work awesome i keep this in the shower okay then i saw Miss Allison Chase. I was looking at one of her videos the other day and she uses the Hydra Beauty Essence Mist by Chanel. It's a hydration protection radiance energizing mist. Let's see what this says. Um, instant hydration concentrate mist for the face. That's all it says. Well, you guys know how I feel about, you know, moistening my skin before applying my skincare and then throughout the day just applying it it's really heavy this is uh 1.7 ounces it smells <sighs> i'm not gonna waste it but it smells amazing oh my gosh it smells so good so i went ahead and i pulled the trigger on this one that i purchased um 
these two Chanel products. Well, hold on. Let me show you something else. Yeah, all the Chanel products that I'm going to show you, I purchased at Macy's. I purchased um, Le Beige, the Healthy Glow Natural Eyeshadow Palette Medium. That's all it says. Okay. And I'm not going to lie. I already used it. Because I couldn't wait. So this is the medium. There is another color that I want to get. I really like the way these go on. Especially for aging skin. So yeah. So I got the medium. I'm loving it. I've already used it twice. But I do plan to um, film a full face. Now. Oh. In that same video. She used the healthy glow sheer color stick now i think i remember when these came out you know the reviews were like oh it's too um there's no color payoff you know you can hardly tell it's on your skin well it does say sheer so i don't know what people were expecting it's not like the uh westman atelier where you put on those and it's like i mean it has color this says specifically says healthy glow sheer color stick okay so let's, I got two of them because I couldn't make up my mind. In her video, I believe she used number 20, but then when I went online and I saw number 24, I was like, gosh, I have to get both. So these are the colors. Um, it comes in a little tube like this with the color on the bottom. So this is uh, number 20. I mean, look at this color already. <laughs> look at that, how beautiful. All right, I'm going to swatch it. I'm going to just put it on my, I'm gonna swatch it, I'm not gonna touch it, and then I'll sheer it out. And this is the number 24. It's a little brighter. So number 20 and 24, 20 and 24. Okay, now I'm going to share them out. I hope you can see it. I mean, I can see it, it's still there. Okay, and that's exactly, I mean, look at the veins on my hands. They still come through, right? Cause it's sheer. And I'm sure that if you were to naturally blush like this, if you had anything underneath, that would still come through. I love them. Love it, love it, love it. I've already tried it on. I think it's, there is a scent, which is oh, beautiful. And it's just a sheer, I mean, what can I say? It's, it's sheer. So these are the Le Beige Stick Healthy Glow Sheer Color Stick, 24 and 20 loving these okay let me let me take off so you can see them side by side i i'm glad i picked these two colors because they 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 are quite different okay okay then i finally got my hands on the new um super loaded tinted highlight in the color Po de Sante by Westman Atelier. Oh my gosh, I can't wait to use this. So, let's see. Okay. Comes in this beautiful little pouch. There we go. Oh. Look at this. Oh, wow. This is nice. Okay. It's, there's a slight smell. Okay, I'm going to swatch it for you. So I'm swatching it. Let 
me going deeper. I don't want to dent this. <laughs> oh, how pretty. I hope you can see that color. Wow, that is pretty. That is really pretty. I can't wait to use this. So definitely going to um, create a look using that. Okay, and then finally, I made an order on the Dior website. Obviously, this comes beautifully packaged. I mean, there's nothing like Dior packaging. And the Chanel packaging is pretty nice for, for beauty as well. The presentation is just gorgeous. Okay, this is the receipt. I guess if you want to return anything. I ordered, so I've been trying to get my hands on this blush, I know more blush, um, for a while and I haven't been able to find it. I finally got it. Another Dior blush I want to get my hands on is a Dior Backstage, the color Coral. And I kick myself in the butt for not purchasing it a long time ago when I purchased my um, the face palette. I saw that color, I'm like, ooh, that color looks gorgeous. I'm like, you know what? Let me go to the store and see if I, let me check it out. I, I don't know why I didn't. So this is a blush that um, Michelle Wong made me do it. It's number 459 Charnel. Okay. And if you guys have seen my channel long enough, you know that one of my all-time favorite blushes is the Chanel Old Formula, the color Golden Sun. Well, that I don't know if it was limited. I don't know what, but they don't make it anymore. So this, um, when Michelle Wong bought this, she said it was very close to that. And the color looked amazing. Look at this. Wow. Look at this color. Gosh, let me get that light out of the way. Okay. Let me swatch it for you. This, I'm going to toss this. I never use this. I will keep this. Look at this, how beautiful. All right, let me see where I'm gonna swatch it. I'll swatch it right underneath the, look how soft, oh, look at that. It's right there. It's, I know it might not seem like much, but oh my gosh, I can see it. And I already know, I can already tell, I'm going to love this. It has the slightest sheen in it. You really can't, it's so finely milled that you really can't. But I don't know if you can see that. It has a little bit of sheen to it. It's just gorgeous. All right, I can't wait to use this. I use it tomorrow okay so that's um the blush i got from dior then i i told myself you know i love i mean i love my nudes on my lips um i love the nudes on my lips i'll never get tired of nude lipsticks but i kind of want to dive into you know especially for the summer like a like a corally reddish orange um and i just said you know what let me just bite the bullet let me find something that i can use so i purchased two of the dior addict lip tints okay i purchased it in the color 641 natural red tangerine and 251 natural peach okay so so this is the 
Tangerine 641. Hmm. All right, let me swatch this. I'll swatch this. Here, let me swatch this here. Wow. See, but I like it because, I mean, I'm sure I can build it up, but it's also very sheer. That when it dries up, I can put maybe like a little lip gloss over it, but that color is gorgeous. So let's see. This is Natural Peach 251. It's lighter, so let me put these two side by side. Nice, nice. Okay, so I'm going to, let me just see. I'm just going to apply this on my lips now. I've got a little bit of um, some gold lip gloss on, but let me apply it right over this. Mmm, I like it. It feels, when it goes on, it almost feels like water. It's the weirdest sensation, but it's drying up here. I'll tell you here how it's drying up. Like as the as the air conditioning is hitting it, it feels cool on your lips. It feel it feels cool on your on your skin, and it is. I mean, I want to say it's maybe it'll dry down to a smudge proof formula. I mean, I'm going in there. Let me go in there a little harder. Okay. But it is, I mean, it has staying power. And look at this. These colors are gorgeous. Yeah, so I wanted, I wanted something more, obviously, something more corally, peachy for the summer. You know, like kind of to like lighten up my face a little bit. And get away from those nudes for a while all right what else did i get oh and then like always they include something i don't want to get it dirty this i am keeping let's see i forgot what i ordered or what i requested okay so okay miss dior a little sample for miss dior this is the rose and roses let's see what this smells like mm. Oh gosh, beautiful. And I also this is Eden Rock Christian Dior. Okay, is this for okay? Let's see. Oh, oh wow, this smells nice. Smells nice. Okay. And then I picked up another Dior Addict Lip Maximizer. So I might just look at this. How cute. This is perfect for vacation. Look at this. Let me just have this on top. Mm, very nice. Oh, I love this. This, I don't know how many of these I've gone through. Okay, guys, so that is the haul for today. I've got three videos to come out of this. Or no, maybe, maybe four. Because I do want to play with this CC cream from Supergoop. And then maybe apply a light, no makeup, makeup look. Um, I've got a Dior look to do, and I've also have a Westman Atelier and, of course, a Le Beige, Chanel Le Beige look. All right, guys, thank you for hanging out with me. I hope you like these type of videos. If you do, please give this video a thumbs up. Please comment. I respond to all my comments and consider subscribing so you help 
me grow my channel. All right, guys, take care and I'll see you later. Bye.